lot of ground to cover. True, but unlike your boy Asav, we've got an advantage. The three symbols. Let's have a look at the map. Okay, let's see. We are right about here. I can mark it up as we go. Check out that tower. Bet you could get the lay of the land from up top. Maybe. <laughs> okay, I'll keep an eye out for a soft. Perfect. Not that I'm too worried about him, though. You should be. We won't have the advantage of surprise again. Don't think he was expecting much from you. Wait, was that a compliment? That, that sounded like a compliment. His guys are idiots, but a solve is... We just need to stay the hell away from him. Never understood the appeal of people like Asav. Easy. He finds men who are weak and offers them power. Gives them purpose. Purpose? Sounds more like bullshit to me. How'd you get tangled up with the Sav anyway? Purpose? Rather not go into it. He certainly seemed to have a thing for you. Don't remind me. Proved useful at the time, but... Yeah. Uh, do tell. Rather not. Maybe over drinks? Not enough alcohol in the world. they get bored and leave. Probably won't, unless we ask nicely. Well, here goes nothing. Smash their enemy. Go, 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 go! What the? What was that man? What the? Found! That's it? Think so. Spoke too soon. Heads up! Shit! Shit! 
We're clear. Good. Right, you're the military expert. What's Asav's strategy here? He spread out his men, hoping to stop us in our tracks. Not what I would do. So what would you do if you were Asav? Besides lose the beard? Hang back? Let you do the heavy lifting, then swoop in and grab up the task once you've done all the hard work? Devious. Practical. Mitigates a lot of risks. Lucky you're on my team. Yeah, you are. I'm a little surprised Asav's not doing the same thing. Maybe his expert knows more than we think. Right. All the more reason to wrap this up quickly, then. Rebels haven't left this spot. Yeah. Mm. Let's get a closer look. I see that four by four. Come out! We have company. Where did you go? Hey! 
Here! They are over here! Take the side! Right! Oh shit! What's the shotgun? <laughs> you should not have crossed us! Let's see what we've got here. Interesting. Some kind of Hoysala token. It's not one of our three symbols. Might be worth trading once we get back home. I hope that was productive. Just a token of some kind. Old Hoysala thingy. Think we need it? Need? Probably not. Want? Definitely.
Give me a second. I can wait. Notice anything about this statue? It's holding an axe. One of the three symbols on our disc. Yes, and it's pointing at those ruins. Right. Well done. Glad I'm good for something. Time to go. Rebels might be here already. Hey, look. Shiva's axe. Shiva. It was the god of destruction, right? Yes, but maybe not in the way you're thinking. Not literal destruction, then? That, but also in a more positive sense, like losing the ego, ditching bad habits. Shedding old attachments. Exactly. should do the trick. Okay. Going. Going. Ah! Let's get inside. What do you suppose this place was? 
It's hard to say. A fortress? Not the right layout for a temple. Right. In we go. Ah. Salah versus the tiger. Doesn't seem like a fair fight. Salah won, actually. He was protecting his guru and killed the animal in one blow. It's where the name Hoi Salah comes from. Hoi, meaning strike, in their language. They've left their climbing gear. They should come in handy. Correction. Our climbing gear. Oh. God, a bit hard on the wrists. Than most men. I thought we were talking about your feet. We are. <laughs> yeah. Shit! Watch yourself. out and find them.
Oh my. What the hell is this? Okay, let's see what this does. <sighs> that statue moved. Well, let's see how this goes. Well, I'll be going to hell. That's elaborate. <laughs> oh shit, statue moved again. Ah! Careful. I don't like the looks of this. Look out! I think that did it. Come on over. Coming. Oh, for goodness sake. Three statues, with two different symbols now. A star and three. They're all Hoysala sons. Well, looky here. What are you willing to bet? Told you it's some kind of key. Gold star for you. Now let's see what it does. What is it? Ancient porcelain jigsaw puzzle? Of course. I'm making an axe. Shiva. Now what? Now I guess we turn this crank and see what happens next. You think it's safe? You know that treasure hunting is not a good gig for the risk of us, right? Now there's being a mercenary. Difference is when I pull the pin on a grenade, I know what's going to happen next. My way's much more fun. <laughs> Did you hear that? 
hear that? You feel that? Teresa, mm-hmm. oh. 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 look at that. Holy hell. There's a massive relief carved into the side of that mountain. And you were worried we were going to turn that crank and die. I guess it's good I've got an archaeologist's daughter with me. It must have been fun growing up, eh? It had its moments. I learnt a lot. Voisalar Empire was kind of his thing. Took up a lot of his time, though. Me, if I go digging for treasure, I'd better make a buck or two. Well, sure. I don't take big risks without a good payday. I imagine so. Like running an army, huh? That's a big responsibility. Second nature. It's my father's company. He retired, I took over. Family business? Mm. Made a real mess of it. Well, you should know. Heard you and those Drake brothers are close. Yeah, well, it's a conversation for another time. So, where to next? That fort in the lake bed is certainly worth a look. And probably that fort above the waterfalls. I suppose I should have asked about the dregs before I took the job. Not much to tell. I know Nate pretty well, Sam less so. He seemed to just appear out of thin air. Let's head back to the car. Gotta love a shortcut. Glad we don't have to go back the way we came. I would have made you dodge the axes. Lake bed and waterfalls. I'll do that. <clears throat> hey, just so you know, Nathan Drake is no longer in the picture. You don't have to worry about him. I had my concerns. Why do you accept my offer? I'm not one to look a gift horse in the mouth, especially with everyone wanting to see me fall. I hear that. But on the plus side. Oh, there's a plus side? Oh, when people have low expectations, it's much easier to take them by surprise. As far as I'm concerned, this business is tough enough on your own. You have to take any advantage you can. You always worked alone? Mostly. How old were you when you started? Young. Learned quickly enough I needed to let people think they were getting their way, and then I could get the upper hand. Too subtle for me. I always prefer the direct approach. Yeah, whatever works, I say.
Kravtsov's men might be around. Look up there. Parashurama's bow. So, Parashurama... Parashurama? Parashurama. Who was he again? Okay. Six avatar of the god Vishnu. A fearsome warrior. Trained in the martial arts by Shiva himself, but only after conquering the whole world to convince him of his worthiness. <laughs> I I had a bed. Coming. Copy that. Yeah. Once more, <laughs> with gusto. Here we go. Hey, I'll take care of this one. Okay. Nice to be out of that shithole, finally. I was starting to think the boss was all talk. I'd watch your mouth. Sorry. Soon it won't matter. Once we have the task, the people will follow like sheep. Yeah, even the mighty Indian army will try. Can't wait. That's it. We're clear. Probably a lure to the others. Can't be helped. Come on. There! On the mountain! Here come the others! You boys really don't want me shooting from down here. We're all clear. It won't be the last of them. There was a big truck parked out front. We'll keep our eyes open. We'd better. We'd walk right off a cliff. You do have a sense of humor. <sighs> Would have preferred a head start over a sob. Not much we can do. Besides, doesn't matter who starts, only who finishes. Fair point. Think of those men know what they're looking for? See that? Looks like another faucet. Let's find a way up. Look, 
Follow me. Friends up ahead. They don't know we're here. Good. <clears throat> Amazing, all things considered. You got anything? I think we are good here. Are you there? Hang on. Got one down over here. We are not alone. Move out. Find them. What the? Watch out. Another one down. Keep looking. They are here somewhere. Oh shit, shit, they made us! They are here! Oh, shit, they are here! Clear? We're clear. Good. Good to be clear. Let's press on. Just what I was going to say. <laughs> Some kind of mechanism. Here we go. <laughs> Look, it's opening that gate. Perfect. <laughs> that should do it. at least. Sorry. I'm sure you can find your way over here. Oh, definitely. Figured you'd want to take the easy way over. <laughs> Beg your pardon? Doing all right? I'm fine. Just don't get started without me. Sure. Wouldn't dream of it. <laughs> There you are, having fun. Just like the monkey bars in primary school. I'd say this looks safer than the playground at my school. Uh, nearly there. Made it. I'm impressed. You're impressed. I'm tired. Let's get this done. Right, 
I'm guessing it'll be a bird this time. Good guess. This one's a bit trickier. Sharama. Right. Let's turn the water on. Well, well. What's to say it's not different this time? What if it's fire or something? You're messing with me. I'm totally messing with you. <laughs> Here we go. Mm -hmm. oh. I'm a little disappointed it wasn't fire. Another waterfall. Yeah. It's two out of three now. Ross and I went to an absurd amount of trouble to hide the tusk. Well, the tusk was the symbol of Hoysala dominance, representing their wealth and their might. A nice trophy for the Persians. Yeah. My dad always thought that the tusk was something even greater, though. What? Your dad was after the tusk? Oh, my dad was obsessed with it. He spent every day and night researching it. All our money wasted on fruitless expeditions. Heard that one before. Ugh. So what came of it? I don't know. Well, he sent me and my mum away. He said it was no longer safe. And off to Australia we went. <laughs> and now here I stand, on the outskirts of Halibadu. That's... pretty funny. And the last fort's nestled above the falls. The one with the trident. At least your accent makes sense now. Yeah. 